Hello and welcome to Radiology Lens. In today's video, we will explore the ultrasound findings of a complete hydatiform mole, also known as molar pregnancy. We will be showing real ultrasound images to help you identify key diagnostic features. So what is a molar pregnancy? A molar pregnancy is a type of gestational trophoblastic disease in which abnormal trophoblastic tissue grows inside the uterus. There are two types complete mole and partial mole. Today we focus on complete mole which lacks fetal development and is characterized by a mass of abnormal placental tissue. Now let's look at classic ultrasound findings of a complete hydatiform mole. As you can see here, the ultrasound reveals a heterogeneous echogenic mass with multiple small cystic spaces. This is often described as a snowstorm or a bunch of grapes apparent due to the hydrophobic degeneration of chorionic villi. Unlike a normal pregnancy, a complete mole has no identifiable fetal tissue. The gestational sac is either absent or replaced by abnormal trophoblastic tissue. This image shows enlargement of the uterine cavity due to a mass filled with innumerable small cysts. This is a classic sign of a molar pregnancy. Another image of an enlarged uterus due to a mass with innumerable small cysts. Now this image shows a solid appearing mass that occupies the uterine cavity. It is difficult to say what this mass could be on a transabdominal scan. Now when a transvaginal scan was done on the same patient, you can see smaller cysts that were initially not visible on a transabdominal scan. So this confirms that it is a molar pregnancy. On color Doppler, the complete mole shows minimal flow at the periphery of the mole, but no significant flow in the majority of the molar tissue. The diagnosis of a complete molar pregnancy is confirmed with ultrasound findings, extremely high beta HCG levels, histopathological examination after evacuation. Histopathology confirms the diagnosis by showing swollen chorionic villi with no fetal tissue. Once diagnosed, the standard treatment is suction, evacuation and curetage. Close monitoring of beta HCG levels is crucial to detect persistent disease or progression to gestational trophoblastic neoplasia. To summarize, a complete molar pregnancy is diagnosed based on snowstorm pattern on ultrasound, no fetal development, high beta HCG levels. If you found this video helpful, please like, share and subscribe for more medical ultrasound content. Feel free to leave your questions in the comments below. Thank you.